And this is Sarge here at C4 Defense. We're at SHOT Show, Las Vegas, 2020. I'm here with Obnoxious One, Rick from Belleville Boots. We both wore our Fat Max boots this year, and I can tell you that our feet are in better shape than they were last year. Rick is going to tell us about everything new they have neat for this year, 2020, SHOT Show. Hi, I'm Rick Elliott. I'm a Director of Sales for Belleville Boot Company. I'm going to talk a little bit today about some of our styles and our tactical research line. Uh, tactical research was created about 10 years ago, and the aim for it was to give you a boot that had the stability of a boot and the durability of a boot, but has some athletic shoe inspired characteristics to it. Uh, Craig has already mentioned that they're wearing our Fat Max boot. I'll talk about a little bit of it. Our basic philosophy is there's not one magic boot that meets every purpose. So we try to build boots for you know what different people need, what their job is, what addresses any physical issues they may have. The Fat Max is built on a very thick shock absorbing midsole. And we actually took this idea from a company that makes running shoes for marathon runners. This is sort of like the old Disney movie Flubber, if you remember how you bounce around. So it has oh, almost yeah. like a, a Winnie the Pooh Tigger effect to it. Uh, it also has a Vibram running shoe outsole. This is very durable. The pair that I'm actually wearing myself, I have been wearing for over three years, and you can see how well it's held up all this time. Anyone that is in a job that they're on concrete a whole lot, uh, this is the boot for you. It really will save your ankles, knees, and back. So like I said, this is the call of Fat Max. Basically, his dad was a combat boot, his mom was a feather pillow. <laughs> One of our other popular boots is in our 1040 series. And the idea behind this, this is basically an athletic shoe that has boot characteristics. Um, it has some nice features as far as we do a textile upper here and a lace up. Once again, good aggressive outsole pattern here. It is relatively white, lightweight, yet still has good ankle support here with an effective heel counter and also has an orthopedic grade insert. Um, this is insert is firm under the arch area, so it helps support your feet in load bearing situations. Uh, you may have heard of people having flat feet. It's actually a foot condition called plantar fasciitis where you have strained your arch. What this does, especially once again, when you're walking a lot, is it helps support your foot. This also has a heat um, resistant type lining that helps keep heat down in your foot. It also is ventilated very well. And then lastly, what we've done is sort of the best of both worlds. You have orthopedic support under the arch, but you also have cushioning under the heel. We've cut out this little window here. So once again, takes the shock absorption there. This is also available in leather toe models and a waterproof and non-waterproof model. And then lastly, a series that we've had out for 10 years straight, still our number one selling series, is called the Kyber. Uh, that's named after the Kyber Pass in Afghanistan. We originally were making this boot for use by the U.S. military over there. It was so popular as many soldiers transitioned out into the civilian world, they became police officers and were asked to make it in black. This boot has some real neat features on it. Once again, it's a Vibram outsole. Great for grippability, non-slip. It also has a toe rake on the front. If you're ever in a situation going uphill, a pursuit for situation as an officer, chain link fence, concrete wall, gives you great grip. Same principle in the back, we have a heel brake. So this helps catch you, at least gives you a prayer catching yourself if you start to slip. And then, once again, as many officers are driving a good bit, we have reinforced this here so you don't have rug burn wearing out the boot in the car when you're driving a lot. Uh, this comes as well with a side zip as well as non-zipper and also in waterproof models and also in a six inch. One other feature of this boot is that we actually offer a firm orthopedic grade the whole length here. This is once again for someone that's on the move. If you're in a tactical situation where you need arch and ankle support, you cannot beat the Kuiper series from us. Uh, once again, I'm Rick Elliott with Belleville Boot Company. Appreciate you visiting with us. And for more information, you can go to www.bellevilleboot.com. Forgot one thing. I'm getting senile in my old age. Forgot to tell you about our latest, greatest. Uh, this is a boot we'll be coming out with this summer. It is called the AMRAP. That is for as many repetitions as possible. And basically what this is, you can see how shock absorbing this is right here. What we're using is what's referred to as an extended TPU midsole material. 
This came from the athletic shoe industry. It's sort of the best of both worlds once again. You've got good ankle and arch stability in this boot, but you're going to have a tennis shoe experience with a shock absorption. It's going to be great for training, good for ruck marches. Look for this coming out in June. It's called the AMRAP TR501. Thanks again. There we go. Hey, I just want to take a second to thank Rick for taking time out of his busy schedule to talk to us about all the new boots from Belleville, Tactical Research, and also about some old boots that we're wearing right now. Remember to subscribe, comment, like, hit that notification icon if you're a subscriber. See you on the range. Take care.